Hello everybody, it's me from the Roman Gaming Channel here, and this is a little bit of an apology right before the video. The reason is because the game audio for the next couple of videos was not recorded, so any of the science, civic research, and wonder completion quotes will not be there. I am sorry about this, but there will be a background music, so it's just not my voice. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoy the video, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Hello everybody, it's me again from the Roman Gaming Channel here, and welcome back to another Civilization 6 video. So in this video, I will remember what I was going to do. I think I was declaring war on Peter or I was getting ready to declare war on Peter or something like that. Uh, I'm over here scouting his, his ass. So let me go see. All right. So Peter doesn't have any walls. So it seems like it might be a little bit. It, it will be. I, I feel like it will be easy to take Peter. Uh, I'll see if my scout can reach St. Petersburg and see how fortified it is. It's still 17. Washington, was it Washington of 15, I think? So it's, it's not that different, and we only took it with, uh, with warriors. So now that we have archers, I, I feel pretty confident that Peter will fall to Roman superior superiority, whatever that, fudge, nope. Anyways, Peter will fall to us. There's no doubt about it. I, I, uh, I want to say there's no doubt about it, but <clears throat> you never know, right? Okay. So let's take out this barbarian right here. It's a kill. Awesome. Let's promote these guys. Let's give them... Um... I'll give them better cry. Okay, so let's move out these units as well to war. We should move into the war front. Yeah, so after that, uh, uh, I feel like I'm just gonna take Peter. Take his puny little cities. I'll take his puny little city. And I'll let China do whatever they want over here. Maybe I'll go for an early conquest as well. I don't feel... China also seems like it's very weak. It doesn't seem like it has got a lot of strength. So I might just take him out and plant my own cities over here. Uh, I'll, pin I'll finish the Pyramids of Giza. I, if I remember correctly, I wanted to put the Petra over here. <clears throat> I'll try and see... Oh, we have we have work here. Okay, let's put him over here on the mines so we can get some iron. If I remember correctly, I was going to put Petra here, right? So let me go with pins, add a pin, and... Uh, <sighs> That's the thing, because if I remember correctly, Petra gives, what was it? Oh, there it is. Two food, two gold, and one production to all desert tiles. Uh, must be built on a desert or flood plains without hills. Oh, without hills. Okay. <clears throat> um, To all desert tiles. Okay, so, you, okay, all right. Let's see what we're going to do. We go, got the minute. No, no, no. So we might put the... Petra. Should we put him right here? Um, I should go with it right here, right? Let's put Petra right there. That should be good. Petra should go right there. And then the Colosseum. I think I wanted to put the Colosseum as well, right? S or, or was it just by myself? Or was I thinking that to myself only? I don't remember, but I, I wanted to I want to put the Colosseum. And, and if I remember correctly, let me go to my lenses. Over here there should be where, a city overlay. We got a range mouse, and we want a range of six because I remember the Colosseum is, has a range of six of happiness. So if we place the Colosseum right here or right here, right here is fine. No, right here. We should place it, the Colosseum right here. I mean, I can put it right here as well. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, because then we can put a city over here, right? So yeah, you know what? I'll put the Colosseum right there. I feel like that would be much better. A much better option right there. It's right. It's, it's already in, in our borders. We don't have to buy any tiles. Uh, yeah, so then I'll put... Okay, there we go. That's what we're going to do. So let's go over here to Ravenna. And we're going to put the Entertainment Complex right here. Because I need a, comp a complex first before I can put, build the, uh, the Colosseum. So we put, put the thing right there. Uh, we want to put it first. There we go. <clears throat> in 12 turns, we will get the 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 complex. Then we can build the Colosseum in 26 turns, which is awesome. That's gonna come in. That's gonna bring happiness to our cities because we do have low 
we have insufficient amenities, which is also uh, a bad thing. And another thing that I was thinking watching through my, well, while, while I was editing videos, is I probably will conquer Kabo as well, because I do like my iron. I mean, I can't get it for if I became friendly with him, but I, I feel like I just want to take it, you know? I just take it. Because then if he gets any of this iron uh, luxury resources, we can we can create a lot of good gold with it. Because I can put a, uh, if I put a city right here, we can put a, a commercial hub right there and it's going to generate big money. So I feel like that's, that's the best option to go with. So that's what I'm going to do. Hold on. Oh god. I'll move this guy right here. Peter, I don't want. Oh, you know what? Yeah, another thing I want to do is I want to denounce him, because right now, if I declare, a, if I declare a surprise war, is I gonna get? I'm gonna get moderate warmonger, warmonger, warmonger penalties, and I don't want that. So I'm gonna denounce him. Just, just gonna like get ready, like you know, to create some friction between me and him. Oh, look at him. <laughs> he got so pissed. My people live through winters more dangerous than your army. Do you think we're afraid of your threats? You better be, boy, because it's Rome threatening you. So see, we can cause we can we can have a little option right there, which is declare a formal war, which our warmonger penalties go go slight, which is exactly what we want. So uh, let's keep moving our war our military over there. Is that is that our turn? I think that's our turn. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, let's go ahead and. Ooh. Oh, somebody play. Uh, created Stonehenge. Okay. Alright, let's see. So yeah, I think that's gonna be the best option. We move our units over here. We will invade through this. Oh, ah. You know what? I think I wanna re... Remove them over here. I think this will be the best spot. Because it's nice and open. Quote, unquote. Peter is in a very nicely fortified. It's just it's just gonna be the beginning wave, the first wave. The first wave is gonna be pretty tough on itself. I mean, it doesn't have walls, so it won't be able to bombard my units. So yeah, I don't th I don't think Peter is gonna be much of a threat here. If he doesn't build walls until I reach there, like in around five turns, five six turns, so I can declare a formal war. I don't think he's gonna put much of a threat. You know, he doesn't have archers. I have archers. I already have the range. Supremacy over him uh, We're gonna send in these scouts as well just so they can be like meat a meat shield. I do like myself a meat shield um, I want to put him on the city so we can heal faster So oh look at this China it's coming in I I think I have a piece. I mean an open border with with China So I'm gonna trust China and leave Rome unprotected because even even if he does try to bombard, well, it doesn't have walls. Huh? I'll, I'll leave it at risky. It's gonna be a risky move. Do I automatically lose if I lose the capital? Uh, no, I, I don't think I do. I don't think I do. Okay, yeah. So if, even if China, for whatever reason, takes my capital, I'll, I'll be able to recapture it. So I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna risk it just so I can mo uh, mobilize my units. Because if he doesn't have any walls, he doesn't have any way, no, no, no possible way of attacking my units, which means it's pretty much a free city. Not much of a threat there, Mr. Peter. Whoa. Three archers. Okay. Three archers, just one warrior over there. He seems like, actually, it might be a little bit of a battle here. One, two, three. He's obviously going to put more of a fight than, uh... Than poor Washington, but I don't think it's much of a threat. I really don't. And yeah, yeah. So also another thing I think I want to do is well, what 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 the fudge? Okay, another thing I want to do is I want to create the my uh, trade routes to come out of Arpium, Arpinium, Arpinum, Arpinum, whatever. So that the so the uh, production rate can go high. And I can uh, construct the Petra much faster. Hey, we got a knowledge on iron working. Great. Hmm. 
Okay, yeah, the picture's gonna go here. We can put a farm here. We can... We can put a commercial hub right here. A farm over here? Because I want, I want to get the farms here. So that... Well, I guess I can put another farm over here if time if I actually desperately need it. But I don't th I don't think that's gonna be much of a threat. I mean I don't think that's gonna be much much choice. I mean like um, much. What's the word I'm looking for here? I don't think I'm th I don't think I'm gonna need it. Period. Two farms. Good. I don't think I need more for food. Just in case, of course, I do have the the oasis here. Anyway, guys, that's it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Not much progress was made today, but. You know, you're not always going to have progress, right? So anyway, guys, catch you guys on the next one.